The boardwalk, I was just in Seaside Heights last weekend. On the boardwalk, people walking around, they're trying to get a semblance of normalcy. I'm not worried about the structure. We know the virus doesn't live very long on things in the heat in particular. I'm worried about the people sneezing, coughing, wheezing, whatever it might be. What is your company doing to keep us safe and to keep these rides and games and restaurants all clean? Good morning, Brian, and thank you for having me. Um, I, I think that at this point in time, facility preparation has to take a multifaceted approach. Um, it's, it's much more than just you know spray and go. Um, you have to think about where your occupants are going to be, where your employees are going to be. You have to start with total disinfection. Um, and then we actually use a uh, secondary protective coating um, that can last up to six months. It's a biostatic uh, surface. EPA calls it a treated article, um, but basically provides for a physical kill in between the cleanings that you're supposed to do on a somewhat daily basis. We also believe environmental controls are huge. PPE is your last line of defense. So things like dividing workers, putting up uh, the, the plexiglass sneeze uh, blocks, um, normal air scrubbers can, can help, and also educating your staff, your customers on the proper way to put on your masks and distance and proper hygiene and cleaning techniques are all important. You know, yeah, Craig, Craig I, I think in, in years past, and we would saw your guys spraying that, by the way, I've seen your guys spraying that stuff, spraying that stuff, we would have thought, oh my gosh, these chemicals, they're dangerous. Now we're like, oh good, they're here to clean. What exactly is in that stuff? What are you spraying into the air? Because sometimes I think, you know, you just want to make sure that what you're breathing, uh, maybe not COVID hopefully, but what the chemicals you're breathing are also safe. What is it? Absolutely. So first of all, there's not one silver bullet for every single circumstance. Uh, what you saw spraying on the, the rides differs to what we used inside of offices. First and foremost, we want to make sure it's safe for people. Um, what you saw spraying on the rides for the disinfectant was um, Decon 30. It's completely green. Uh, the salesman actually sprays it in his mouth. I don't think he's supposed to, but um, it, it's, it poses no threat whatsoever to people. Um, and inside offices, we use a product called Sterimist, 